Are you ready to experience the fastest SSD speeds ever? The Sabran Rocket 5 promises insane 14 GBS read speeds thanks to PCIe Gen 5 technology, but it's really as fast as they claim. Today we are going to unbox, install and benchmark this beast to see if it's worth the hype. Let's get started. Before we open it up, let's take a moment to appreciate the packaging because when you spend money on high-end, even box should be feel premium, right? The matte black finish, it gives a premium touch. This doesn't feel like a cheap packaging. The box is sturdy, compact and feels high quality like when you unbox a high-end gaming mouse or flagship smartphone minimalize branding with the rocket 5 logo and pci gen 5 clearly display no unnecessary fluff just straight to the point now the front of the box you can see a picture of the ssd itself so you know exactly what you're getting a sticker for free uh, Acronis True Image cloning software, a handy tool if you are migrating from an old drive. Back of the box, key features and specification listed, including PCI Gen 5 support and 14 GBS speeds, a warning that heat sink is required. A crucial point because these Gen 5 SSDs run hotter than previous generations. Compliance marks like FCC, uh, UKCA prove it meets international safety standards. It's kind of a, like a getting the key to a luxury sports car before seeing the car itself. It builds up the excitement. You already feel like you are handling something powerful. All right, let's open this up and see what we have got inside. I'm going to open. Let me use this tweezer wow it's come with another box inside let me put this away so look at this so on the side we can see rocket 5 advanced performance and actual picture one terabyte this is awesome this is another another box and premium quality open it up wow so this, this is another metal box and you have this a guide. I don't know for what, but let me so carefully have another protection for the... Now let me check what else we have inside. So the box come like this, very professional way. Here's the product. All right, now let's take a closer look at this ssd on the front you can see branding pci gen 5 logo and of course the storage capacity one uh, terabyte now flipping over to the back side we have a sticker with product details certifications and a qr code but here's the big question should you peel this off do not remove this sticker this one oh this one right so unlike cheap product uh, labels, these stickers is not just for branding. It actually has heat resistant coating and might even help with minor heat deception. Important points. Removing this sticker may void your warranty. Some SSD place memory chips underneath the sticker. Removing it might damage components. If your motherboard has a heat sink, the sticker won't interfere with the cooling. So unless you like taking risk, keep this stick on. Now let's talk about the metal plate on the top. Um, unlike the sticker, this is an actual heat spreader designed to help with cooling. Should you remove it, keep it on if you're using the SSD with an aftermarket heat sinks. Remove only if you are installing high performance SSD heatsink or using a motherboard integrated heatsink. PCIe Gen 5 SSDs run hot, so cooling is important. If you have a dedicated heatsink, you can carefully remove this metal plate, but otherwise, the best to leave it on for passive cooling. 
Uh, let's jump into the benchmark results. Uh, read speed is uh, 14,600 MBS and the wide speed is 12,000 MBS. Now, some of the benchmark results is you can still run uh, read speed. Uh, we got near max advertised speed and we get the right speed, excellent sustained performance. And the random read IOPS fast response for small files and the random write IOPS uh, we get great for intensive workloads and the storage score strong general system performance and the gaming score for the 3d excellent game loading times and uh, file transfer large files very fast moving large game files or videos and the windows boot time 4.3 seconds nearly instant startup now the uh, key observation is blazing, uh, blazing fast speed for in real world application like gaming large file transfers gaming performance excellent with cyberpunk 2077 loading in in just over five seconds that looks awesome uh, runs hot so active cooling or heatsink is recommended ideal for ai workloads content creation and high speed gaming setups now let's jump into the thermal performance you can see red and green without the heat sinks it when temperature peak 78 celsius with the heat sinks it uh, went to 56 celsius during the same workloads let's jump into the gaming performance you can see i tested three uh, suburban rocket fire pci gen 4 ssd and sat ssd you can see cyberpunk 5.2 loading time uh, baldur gateway 3 is 8 seconds call of duty warzone is 6.3 seconds microsoft Fly flight simulate is 8.7 seconds so now gaming performance analysis the the subran rocket file load cyberpunk 5.2 seconds which is approximately 50 percent faster than the typical pci gen s4 ssd that's awesome right for large open world games like Microsoft Flight Simulator, the performance difference is even more noticeable with loading times reduced by up to 47%. Now, compared to all the SATA SSDs, Rocket 5 offers three, uh, four faster loading times across all the tested games. Now, uh, that's all for the benchmark stuff. I'm planning to buy the Samsung series and I'm going to do the benchmark with this. So wait for that video and if you like this video please give me a thumbs up and like subscribe to my channel and i'll see you on my next video thank you